Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. And in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you're having an issue with your Bluetooth devices like your mouse, headphones, or keyboard on your Windows 11 computer. This tutorial will apply for Windows 10 as well. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So first thing we're going to do is open up the search menu and type in services. Best results should come back with services, so go ahead and open that up. You want to locate the Bluetooth services, which should be pretty high up in the list here. And you want to make sure they're all running. So in our case, we have three different Bluetooth services here. And you want to just double click on each one. Make sure startup type is set to automatic. And if service status is stopped, you want to select the start option. And you'll select apply and OK for all of these here. So again, make sure they're all set to automatic and running. And then once that's done, close out of here and open up the search menu. Type in troubleshoot. Best match to come back with troubleshoot settings. Go ahead and open that up. On the right side, select other troubleshooters. And then you want to scroll down underneath other and select Bluetooth and then the run button that corresponds to it. So you can see it did resolve an issue here. So go ahead and close out of here. And one final thing I would recommend trying would be to open up the search menu once again. Type in device manager. Best results should come back with device manager. Go ahead and open that up. And you want to expand the Bluetooth section. And then anything under here, you want to right click on it. Select update driver and then browse my computer for drivers. Select let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. And then just again proceed with the on-screen prompts here. And you'll do that for any Bluetooth devices that are listed under here. So you would just right click on it, select update driver, browse my computer for drivers. There's a couple different ways you can update the driver through device manager, but I want to just keep it consistent for this tutorial here for you guys. I think simple is always best, especially if you can make it simple. So anyway, keeping true to that, we're going to do the final one here just to show you guys. So right click, update driver. Browse my computer for drivers, and then let me pick from the list of available drivers on my computer. I'm used to just double clicking on it and then going to the driver tab and then updating it that way, but I feel like this might be a little bit easier for you guys just to visualize it by doing it the same way for all of them. So anyway, once we're done with that, you do want to close out of here and restart your device. And there you go, guys. Hopefully I was able to resolve the issue of having your Bluetooth devices, if you're having problems disconnecting it or perhaps reconnecting it. The title of this video was more, if you can't remove the devices, we kind of have to turn everything on or update it in a sense just to get better functionality perhaps. So definitely was a pretty straightforward process. Do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.